Ferrari's driver Charles blamed himself on Sunday for a French Grand Prix crash that left his Formula One title hopes disappearing into the distance. The Mongas screamed in rage and frustration over the radio after he spun mid-corner and plunged into the tire barrier at the 11th corner on the 18th of 53 scheduled laps. Unable to reverse his car out of the barriers, Leclerc was forced into his third retirement of the season. He had been leading from pole position and while he remained second in the championship. There are a mighty 63 points now separating Leclerc from Red Bull's race winner Max Verstappen with 10 races to go. I am your host Mike from Formula One Universe. Charles has opened up his emotions after the crush. Leclerc doesn't believe at this stage his retirement was caused by a mechanical issue, and added that he feels he has thrown away 32 points in 2022 with mistakes despite performing at the highest level. No, it wasn't a mechanical issue or at least I don't know yet if it was, he said. But, no it doesn't look like it was. It was just a mistake. He added, obviously it's extremely frustrating. I feel like I'm performing at probably the highest level of my career since the beginning of the season. But there's no point performing at that high level if I am doing those mistakes. The crash brought out an immediate safety car while the car was removed and barriers repaired. It was Charles' third retirement while leading a race this season after Spain and Azerbaijan. Ferrari team boss Binotto said the crash was a genuine driver error, and Charles' radio comments about the throttle failing referred to a failed attempt to reverse out of the barrier. It was just a mistake, it happens as we may have reliability issues. He said, I think what I said to Charles was that we make our lives a bit more difficult, but we will enjoy it more in the future if we turn it round. Quick update. Perez admits that the timing of the virtual safety car period ending was what caught him out. First of all, we should have another podium. I don't know what was going on with the virtual safety car. I just got caught up with it, because it was ending already from the exit of turn 8, and it ended up at the end of turn 15. So there was something going on there and I got caught up with it. Speaking to Sky Sports F1, after the race Wolf said, we need to stay humble. Our car is just not good enough at the moment to fight with the guys in front. I'm always a little bit pessimistic because I think I need to be. We are just lacking six or seven tenths to the leaders. Overall, I think the team effort was great. The drivers did a really good job. Red Bull team principal Horner confirmed that they were attempting an undercut with Verstappen, but he was disappointed not to see how the differing strategies played out. We hit the button earlier and went for the undercut, Max effectively got track position, and it's a shame we didn't get to see how that would have played out. 